everybody welcome back to my channel it's me zoe and yeah in today's video i have my um top five favorite fresh scents for fall plus two honorable mentions that have more of a like gourmand with a fresh aspect so i have like a main five and then two extras that are kind of just honorable mentions so yeah i'm coming fresh face today because my skin needs some help um anyways and sometimes makeup irritates my skin just because it doesn't really matter what makeup or whatever but yeah so the first one I actually do not still own but I will put pictures on the side somewhere so move over for now um, um the first one is sweater weather and I absolutely love this and I did use it up my last product used it up and it is very strong some people say it's like a masculine scent but I don't personally think it's too masculine leaning I just think it's more of a fresh crisp breezy scent it does i think the notes are like crisp leaves orchard woods and something else but yeah i'll put a picture on the side um and notes on the bottom but i do absolutely love that fragrance and it was so nice and i'll probably pick it up at some annual sale this year or on the five dollar sale they're doing at the outlets for the body care when that one gets there but yeah that's my first one <laughs> so move back over and the second one is also from that collection and of course that's ivory cashmere the notes on this are fresh like said air silver musk and white amber so it has the the air note but um this is a definitely perfumey fresh scent you definitely get that strong airy musky note but the amber definitely gives it a softness so definitely has like a fall softness but the amber and um the like said air so that's the second one and the packaging is super beautiful on this. It's like the perfect color and the perfect design. It's just very pretty. And I wish they did more collections that are this like soft and beautiful. So yeah. The next one is from the Rocho collection and this is the Golden Hour Coast scent. The notes on this are Sunkissed Bergamot Golden Pear Radiant Woods. So this definitely has a woodsy crisp note just like um sweater weather but the bergamot and the pear which are both fresh scents give it this crisp fresh yet slightly fruity note and the woods gives it that like um more comforting kind of scent so i love this one and the packaging again is like very pretty I don't know, it won't focus, but it's okay. Um, yeah, again, this is a very nice one. It is very light, um, but it is currently $5 at the outlet. And I have the lotion to that one as well. I don't have the shower gel yet, but I'll probably end up getting it soon. And yeah, it is one that both of my mom and I like, which is a rare occasion that we both like actually like it. But I would say the um, strength on this is not very high. So if you're looking for something super strong, I would not suggest that, but it is a very nice fragrance. The next one is cozy season and the reason I picked this one is because the notes are soft lavender golden honey and creamy oak and personally lavender is a very fresh scent in my opinion and although this does have the honey and the oak I feel like the lavender really does give it a nice like spritz I've got like a bad one like the mist is kind of weird but it's fine yeah although you get that sweet drippy yet kind of ambery honey with that oak there is like a bottom note or something of a fresh, not springy lavender, but a fresh like breezy lavender. It gives it this nice aspect of warm coziness, but also a hint of freshness. It's a perfect mist and I really love this one. I keep liking it more and more every time I smell it. So yeah, cozy season again, beautiful packaging. I just love this so much. And I'm so thankful they brought out a lavender scent. Finally, that is not just lavender and other fresh scents because it has lavender and a sweeter scent, like a woodsy scent. So I'm very thankful that even though it has a similar name, it wasn't like cozy Sunday morning or cozy evening because I didn't like either of those. But yeah, I'm so excited that there's finally an amazing lavender scent that is more sweet, um, but also has still has a nice fresh, for the nice freshness that lavender typically has. And the fifth one is Cloud Nine. And I know this came out in the there we go. I know this came out in the um in the spring. 
but in my opinion it is a very nice crisp fall scent. The notes are lavender breeze, morning dew drops, and cozy amber. So of course the lavender breeze and the dewiness and then the amber makes it like more of a fall scent in my opinion. So yeah. And again the packaging on these are very nice. So I do really enjoy the packaging on this. It's very pretty, very aesthetic. Although it doesn't look super nice next to other mists. Um, it does look pretty by itself, I think. But yeah, so you definitely get that fresh, crisp lavender and what was the other note? And like dewy aquatic flowers. But you do get a hint of like a warm amber, like a hint. So I do think this is a perfect fragrance for fall. I'll have a fresh one. And now onto two more gourmand or fruity like scents that have a fresh note for fall. So the first one is Black Raspberry Vanilla. This is like a tried and true one. I think for almost three years now, except for last year, they came out this one like every Christmas SAS. So honestly, I don't really like the packaging. It's kind of cheap looking, I guess. The fragrance is really nice. I should have brought the lotion, but um, this does have some, this has an orchid note. So um, it does give it a bit of freshness. Yeah, so there's definitely that like berry, but it's a very fresh berry. It's like a fresh pick berry, you've washed it in water. It's not like a cooking sweet caramelized berry. It's definitely a fresh um, blackberry. And the vanilla is definitely more of a fresh vanilla in my opinion. This is not a gourmand scent, it's more of a fresh fruity scent with a hint of warmth. Yeah, it smells so good. There is a fresh note in this, so that was a um, extra mention. The last one is, of course, Coconut Candy Apple. The packaging of this is very beautiful. Um, the notes are Candy Red Apple, Shredded Coconut Vanilla Spice. And although you do get a lot of that coconut and like a creamy vanilla, slightly hint of spice note, that apple, the appleness is just so fresh and fruity and crisp and fall-like. It's not like a baked apple or a bakery apple. The only bakery notes in this is like the coconut and vanilla, but that, sorry, <laughs> that apple is just so crisp, so fresh, like you're walking to an apple orchard and you take a bite out of a crisp, sweet, sweet yet like, not like bakery sweet kind of apple. So yeah, yeah, it's definitely a crisp apple, a fresh apple with that sweetness. So yeah, basically the first five ones if you like true <laughs> fresh scents and these last two are runner-ups for Fruiting Romans with added freshness. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I'll see you later. Bye.